Welcome, welcome again to Military Guna TV. Thank you very much for joining me again. And I have big news for Arsenal. Now, Arsenal are looking down the table for players which are suitable for the Premier League or are already in the Premier League. Now, if you do like this content, please hit the like button. Also, subscribe if you're new and sit back, take out your popcorn and relax, watch and enjoy. Now, Arsenal are in have shown keen interest in Sander Burge from Sheffield United. Now, this, this was quoted, this report is coming from Sheffield United News. Looking in from afar, it appears Chris Wilder has already put the wheels in motion when it comes to Sheffield United losing Sander Burge. Without conceding, he lost Burge this very summer. Wilder's interview this week with TV2, TV2 offered a frank and honest admission that Burge was already likely to use United, Sheffield United as a stepping stone. It is a realistic approach from the Blaze boss. Burge was a big money, was a big money, and if we're being honest, surprising signing back in January 2020. Since then, Burge has shown his class, especially at time this season, the post lockdown. Post lockdown, although injury has, although injury has curtailed his progress recently. Should United allow, lose Burge this summer when it went and if relegated, then as well as looking to get money back and some more. The Blaze should also have an eye on few clubs to which losing Burge wouldn't be the end of the world. And one of them clubs should be Arsenal, and one of them clubs is Arsenal. Was previously showed interest in signing Burge themselves. Obviously, the main thing United need to look at when selling Burge is ensuring they get, they get their money back. £22 million pounds shouldn't be too hard for, for them to get an international midfielder, while you should also look to insert a selling clause also in the deal. But if Arsenal do rekindle their apparent interest there's an handful of young and exciting talent who would, who would blaze could potentially look to pinch a loan from for any deal midfielder reese nelson is another, is another that, that have been mentioned previously nelson has a box of talent but finds himself on the fringes of the first team action under Mikel arteta beyond that you have the likes of miguel aziz is a highly rated midfielder player in arsenal ranks and a move to the championship if we do end up in there could aid his development Joe Willock is all, already on loan to Newcastle. Forlan Balogun has yet to decide his future, while the likes of Amola and Rekik are an, another highly rated youngster um, who are at the fringes of entering into the first team. So while losing Sunderberg won't be an ideal for the Blades, the thought of going to Arsenal and us, at least seeing someone arrive in return, would be a good thing to consider. So that is coming directly from news outlet. Now let me get into the player's profile and let you get a better understanding of the player. Now Sander is was born on February 14th on Valentine's Day 1998. His place of birth, Borium from Norway. Um, his height is 1.95 meters. Pretty very, he's very, very high. I'm tall for a youngster, age 23 years of age. Now he joined a new Sheffield United um, January 30, 2020. His contract expires January 30, 2024. So he will cost a fee to prize away from this team. His main position is defensive midfield, and other position that is suitable for are the central midfield position. Now his current market value is 18 million, and his maximum market value is 22 million, and that is what actually Sheffield United got for him so far this season. He had played 14 games, one goal, one assist. And for a youngster who is, as a midfielder, they are not that prolific in regards to goal scoring. But for a youngster in such such a fragile age com coming up, I can see that there's a lot of potential, bags of potential there for him to progress. So hopefully you guys get a much from that. So Sandberg on to Arsenal is a likely possibility. Should happen. Is it going to happen? Now big news coming out of the Sheffield News. Sheffield United news outlet that it can happen. So hopefully you guys um get a better understanding of what is happening. And please leave a like, hit the comment if you think Arsenal should go in for this player. And guess what? This has been Military Guna TV, and I am out.